Continuing election coverage now. The votes are in for Newsom's, the town where not a single person filed to run for any of the seats, including mayor. That's right. The ballot remained blank. We first brought you this story back in April. The voters had to write in people for seven elected positions. Then your size, Laura Queso, has those results tonight. Laura? Yeah, and according to the registrar's office, Vanless Worrell took the most votes, 15 write-ins. We've learned he did put an ad in a local paper there. However, he has to accept a position, which we've told he hasn't done yet. Coming in second, Joseph Stewart with 12 votes and Wesley Story with seven. Town council results also came in. There were nine write-in candidates, and the top six must agree again to fill the positions. The results came in just after one today, and we're told it took a bit longer to get all the results in from the write-ins because, well, Everyone who lives in the town is essentially a candidate. The question is here, how did the town of Newsom's get to this point where voters had no options to elect new leaders at the polls? Several current officials simply say they all forgot. They tell us turmoil in town hall distracted them from the race, so no one remembered to file to be a candidate. Newsom's acting mayor Harvey Porter resigned Monday during the town council meeting. I'm told a new mayor should start June 1st. For a full list of results, head to wavy.com. I'm live in the newsroom, Laura Queso, 10 on your side.